I fix something OpenGX couldn't. Their annoying UI. So I'm going to show you today how to get this UI back very easily. So let me show you how you use to do it. So I'm going to open my Opera GX just like this. And the only thing you had to do is start a new speed dial, go to widgets and then you can refurb. But they removed this, like you remove this and don't give the people the option to go back. And what they did is this, like you go to this option and the option to give you is a preset. Like this is not the old UI. This is not the classic, we all know this. So let me show you how to get back to the old version and this is a permanent video it's not gonna get patched so first of all go to the description in the video and then we're going to a ftp website which allows us to download a file from their servers so let's go there and i already opened it i'm sorry this is what you would see you have to click on windows if you're windows and mac if you're mac so let's go to windows and right here let's make sure that you click on this setup file right here after doing that, it's going to your download folder. What we now need to do is delete your old Opera Jigs. So let's search for Opera Jigs just like this. Let's go open this window and then click on uninstall. Right here, let's search for Opera GX just like that. A little bit different. And then let's click on these three dots and click on uninstall. Let's do that. After doing this, the only thing you have to do right now is uninstall. You're not going to delete your user data. That's not necessary for this tutorial. Let's click on uninstall just like this and then it's going to give you a pop-up in a different browser doesn't really matter what we now need to do is go back to our downloads folder because it has been downloaded the old ui so right here we have this version which is before the date of 16th of may which when they patched it so this one is before that and it's working after opening the setup file you will see this or maybe a pop-up screen with windows saying smart screen or something you just click on ok and allow just continue right here go and click on accept and install very easily and right here let's click on accept again and it's going to install the old ui but first of all we have to switch it back because we will get the revert button back so let's do that when it's installed make sure to subscribe to the channel because this way we can make more useful videos like this and not waste your time make sure you repost this on reddit or some other platform you'll get your own upvote and people will love this video you will see this pop-up profile error record your profile cannot be used because it's a newer version of OpenGX, which means maybe that your account won't really connect but let's click on ok and now we have the old ui if you don't have the old ui back yet just like this doesn't really matter let's click on plus right here the speed dial let's go to widgets and right here you will see the revert button so let's click on it and then this ui is bad <laughs> why are you rolling back because it's bad okay revert and relaunch and now you will launch your old ui back yeah and you gotta click once more this because it's a new update again somehow right here we have the old ui back which is so great you can actually play around with this and it's completely working the only thing you need to do is actually pretty much never update and this way you can always keep your favorite opigx ui so i'm gonna relaunch it and there you go you see that there's no pop-up make sure you subscribe i mean i took hours of this and no reddit post no video is showing you how to do this so this is an original repost it on any platform you can and it's completely free you can just use my footage i don't really care get your own views get this out there please <laughs> i mean it's fixed now so i want to thank you so much for watching make sure to subscribe to the channel so we can keep growing make more useful videos i'm also working on more samsung notes videos because some people can't really use it on their own devices uh more patches are coming up um, i'm gonna try to do my best but i'll see you in the next one thanks so much for watching goodbye